Hi, welcome to Cash Canada, and this is What's Up Wednesday, a new feature we're going to put out. And if you are missing the One Minute Wednesday, it'll be back occasionally. But uh, right now, we would like to introduce you to two geo vloggers and a cruise director, kind of sort of. And uh, we have uh, Land Monkey and Land Sharks from British Columbia, both of them. Good morning, or good afternoon, or good evening, whenever you're watching. <laughs> Hey there, I'm Jay, uh, better known as Land Monkey. I am uh, the geocaching vlogger type guy. Uh, you can find us on YouTube at Land Monkey Geocaching Adventures. Follow us there. Or, hey, if you want to listen to audio, cash catch us, cash us on the Caching in the Northwest Geocaching Podcast, the only geocaching podcast from the home of geocaching. And I'm Chris, I'm one half of Land Sharks. Helen is the other half. Uh, we run a geocaching supply company in Victoria, British Columbia. We also um, organize geocaching cruises, which is what we're on right now, and in Southern Caribbean. So, um, hi to all you in winter, Winterland if you're, if you're watching this at this time of year. Um, so, uh, we also do uh, run a, a vlog, and you can find us on Go Land Sharks on YouTube. How did we all come together? 69 people. Yeah. How did you manage it? <laughs> well, I think it was somewhat coincidence. <laughs> but um, the cruises have become more and more popular. Uh, we've done, this is uh, number four now. We've, this is the second one in the Caribbean. We've done a Baltic cruise and we did an Alaska cruise. So this is your second one, I think? Uh, this is our third, third, third one. Third one. Yeah. And, and um, our first, our very first cruise. <laughs> yeah. Well, you see, you can't just do it once. Yes. <laughs> um, and, and just the words getting out there about the cruises, they're a lot of fun. And um, so, so yeah, just the community starts coming together over these kinds of things. And it's it's great to have a, to, to have three of us here. It's awesome. Yeah. And Jay, um, how long have you been vlogging? I've been vlogging for about five years, um, podcasting for about the same amount of time. Yeah. We just started, we've been doing little videos here and there. Um, for probably five or six or maybe even more years but we've only been sort of doing more of a vlog style um, in the last year and it came about because we are going to be doing a number of videos that are more um, frequently asked questions that we get in our through our business so things like how do you start geocaching what do you, how do you how do you activate a trackable that kind of stuff so we're putting those together now um, but as we're doing that just getting used to being in front of a camera we started doing a bit more sort of recording of our uh, our adventures and we get to go to some pretty cool places. So, um, so yeah, we've been sharing that with yeah. friends, family, and other geocachers. Where does geocaching take you? I could take you to some really cool spots. Oh, oh I can. All over, all over North America for our vlog, uh, plus plus Europe, uh, Europe. Europe. Yeah. yeah, we did the Baltic series. So if you check out the Land Monkey YouTube channel, you can see the previous cruise. Yeah, uh, we did with the Land Sharks, which was an amazing adventure to Iceland, Norway, Sweden. Finland, Russia, Estonia, and Latvia. Next cruise is Mediterranean. It leaves out of Rome in late or mid October 2019, and um, and it, it just does a whole bunch of whole bunch of countries around the Adriatic. And uh, I can't I can't even list them off the top of my head. There's so many, but we just love lighting up the map and exploring new places. And um, but you can find details at travel.landsharks.ca. That's Landsharks, L-A-N-D-S-H-A-R-K-Z. Or Z if you're in south of the 49. I wish I wish we could go, um, but any plans beyond that? Yeah, we we definitely have plans beyond that. We have a few things we're kind of working on right now that will determine when we when we do our next cruise. Um, we're certainly looking at, very seriously at a another one down in this region that would probably go down um, into the Panama, um, Central America, Panama, Mexico, those kinds of those kinds of stops. Um, whether it be from like the west coast down and around and back up to Florida, something like that, or it might be a down and a down and back. Um, some of the countries in Central America are easy to get to from the Pacific side, other ones from the Atlantic side. So, um, yeah, so something that, that something that does that. Maybe a little bit of South America in there or something. We'll see. Have you been to South America before, Jay? Uh, not yet. Um, the the Panama cruise is a very exciting idea for us. We would love to do that. Uh, getting through the Panama Canal is just one of those bucket list things for a lot of people. Yeah. So to have the opportunity not only to get it's like six or seven new countries to light it's up your map. For me. <laughs> there <Yeah>. you go. <laughs> but also to actually do a daytime passage through the Panama Canal. 
um, which I'm pretty sure you can probably get an earth cache or a virtual while you do that too. But yeah, just, yeah. On, just on the balcony. There, yeah, I got the earth cache. There we go. It's good. Yeah. And you do it legitimately, right? Yeah, yeah science true. Yeah, I read a book, uh, it was recommended by Ronald Reagan, I read uh, his diaries, and he uh, recommended this book, so I bought the book, and it was on the building of the Panama Canal, oh, yeah, and absolutely. it's a fabulous read about what they went through to dig that channel, and uh, so I would love to go through it, just to have that experience of going through something that was written about uh, 100 years ago, that they did NASA, so it's yeah. amazing. Um, what about vlogging, uh, Jay? Uh, you have a great channel. Your, your your area of the country is so fabulous. The the, the scenery is I mean, is incredible. We don't have hills in, in, in Ontario that much. <laughs> well, you have hills. You don't, don't have, have hills. We don't have mountains. <laughs> yes. uh, yeah. So thanks. Um, as I said, we've been going for about five years. We've put together some really cool adventures. And what we started doing with our vlog is we actually do it like watching television. So we have seasons. And so there's an overall theme for each season, uh, an overall story, and then uh, there's multiple episodes, about 10 per season, and it tells a story. So season one is the Baltic adventure that takes you to all those amazing countries I mentioned. Season two is all about traveling the back roads of British Columbia and Washington and Oregon and that whole area and everywhere we've explored in the past year and just taking you to some really neat places you might not see, old pioneer cabins and uh, abandoned gold mines and just amazing cool stuff that you just won't see otherwise. And of course, as you said, lots of mountains and rivers and big trees. We get big trees where yeah. we have. Um, have you guys ever vlogged together? I mean, besides the Baltic. We know we went to the Baltic. Okay. Besides like him sneaking in behind me while I'm yeah, filming like and gone on bombing. Yeah. <laughs> have you been in any of his episodes? Um, um, we've been on a number of podcasting episodes because they all he also is part of a podcasting team. Uh, we've done lots of podcasts. In fact, they ran a podcast from our store in Victoria uh, just before Christmas, which was, was a, lot a lot of fun. fun. Yeah. And um, but we haven't actually collaborated on a on a vlog as such at this up to this point. Uh, we've done it on some of the islands here. We did uh, we did shoot a lot of footage kind of together, and I can imagine there might watch be a for season bit, three. <laughs> might be a little bit of back and forth on some of that. We have to wait that long. We have to wait till 2020. <laughs> I no, can't wait. It'll be out for 2020. Oh, good, for sure. okay, good. Um, so we have a number of social media channels which uh, we're present on um, YouTube, of course, Go Land Sharks. Also Instagram, Go Land Sharks. We're posting on there every day, and we also have Land at Land Sharks on Twitter and Facebook. And Facebook, uh, Facebook and Instagram are the two. Well, we're interactive on all of them, so yeah. you can feel free to um, connect with us on any of those channels, and we'll be happy to. It is. We're the only brick and mortar geocaching store, and uh, yeah. there's 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 not a lot of even online yeah. stores anymore. Yeah. Um, but landsharks.ca, that's yeah. sharks with a Z on the end, .ca, and uh, we have the online store there. And of course, if you're in the Victoria region, uh, coming out to visit the West Coast, just feel free to drop by. We'd love Someday. to see you. It's, yeah. it's yeah. on our list. We've got to go. And how far, where are you? You're on the mainland. So, yeah, we're, we're in, uh, according to Chris, we're in Eastern Canada, which means... <laughs> <laughs> That's right, he is. Yeah. Which, which means that we Not are... Not in the Maritimes where we are in Ontario. <laughs> <laughs> which means that basically we're uh, just outside of Metro Vancouver. And uh, it's a beautiful place to visit. Um, once you're either in Victoria or Metro Vancouver, it is a very short drive to get out into the big trees and the mountains and the ocean and it's one of the best places in the world to geocache for sure. A, a must do cache around you. A must do cache in our area? I don't know, there's there's so many really good ones, it's hard so to pick anything one. Anything that pops into you like uh, So you, if, if you're in like Vancouver, right? Anywhere, anywhere in the southern BC. Uh, if you're in store cache. I, yeah, if you're in southern BC, <laughs> no seriously. The Land Tricks have a yeah. really cool gadget cache outside their store, definitely worth trying. Um, it's got a huge number of favorites, a lot of people really yeah. like it. Yeah, All right. That's, um, that's fun. If you're if you're on the mainland, if you can't make it over to the island, there's a good handful of great gadget caches and there's some amazing mystery caches. Um, there's, there's a real great variety, thousands of fantastic geocaches. You can you could spend weeks geocaching. I thought of something else. If you're coming out and you're a geocacher, you need to do the Richmond Geo Tour. Um, it's one of the better geo tours in the whole area. Um, Tons of great caches, a real variety of, of the cache hides. 
and a lot of fun. So that's definitely worth doing. That would take you almost a full day to do the full geo tour, but it's a day well hey, worth spending. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's it. That's it. Yeah. bring up geo tours. We've just started doing a lot of geo tours. We, the geocaching capital of Canada, which is more than a day. It's two and a half, I think, if you did the whole thing all at once. Um, we're approaching, I think, our fourth day, and we'll have it finished this March. We're hoping to get it finished. And also the fourth uh, region, uh, Peterborough area geo tour. And you get coins. Do you get coins for that? You get. I think they. They, Do they still have some. I think the coins are gone, but you can get the trackable tags. Okay. Oh, that's cool. That's so awesome. yeah. 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 We've been enjoying geo tours a lot. Actually, there's also the Olympic Peninsula geo tour and some others. And we've been doing some vlogs actually around geo tours. And we're going to do another one before we go home, but to BC. We're spending a couple more days in Florida here. We're going to be going to Tampa. I think it's called Flying High is the name of the geotour. It's a small geotour in a bird sanctuary area in Tampa. So we'll, we'll uh, put a vlog together and, and share our adventure there. Looking okay. forward to that. That's awesome. And uh, we'll put a link in the bottom uh, about geo tours. There is, there are sites that are strictly dedicated to geo tours. Geocaching.com has that as well as geo tours. There's so many you can do. Look them up. They are an awesome, awesome experience. Well, thank you very much, both of you, thank for you. joining us here on Cash Canada on What's Up Wednesday. I know it's not really Wednesday. But <laughs> All right. Thank you very Wednesday, one of these days. <laughs> Hey, where will geocaching take you? Hope you'll join us again for another uh, One Minute Wednesday or a What's Up Wednesday. We never know what will happen store here on Cash Canada. Come back and see us. Thanks. Yeah.